weapon and he said the world is enmity from the most high. So I'm like, so in, in, in man's and in the natural man's eyes, that would be a contradiction. Exactly. That's why I said, oh, the Bible's full of contradictions. No, you just yeah, unlearn. I don't understand. Yeah, I'm talking about you making his work. Um, um, the new freshman is new, man. Me, I should break it. Man. That's why I said, but that scripture alone shows you that the statutes, laws, and commandments is given to the Israelites, and the Israelites shall enforce it upon the heathens. All right? Because they all say, oh, because heathens love saying, oh, well, if we got to follow the statutes, laws, and commandments too, doesn't that mean the Lord's dealing with us? No, 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 no. I always give this comparison. Yep. If, your, if, if, your, if, your, if your child brings one of his friends from school into your house, and you walk in there and his friend's jumping on the bed, who are you gonna go to? Are you gonna go to his friend and be like, hey, you can't do that? Or are you gonna go to your child and say, hey, why is he jumping on your bed? You know the, you know the rule households. He said, don't have him do that, go tell him that. And he's gonna go tell his friend, hey, we can't do this, you know, such, 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 such. Your son knows the rule, the household the rule. But guess what, he has to enforce everybody that comes in there that he brings into it, man. Just the same thing with the, uh, uh, with the Lord in Israel. The Lord gave us these statutes, laws, commandments, which eventually he's going to write in our hearts. And then guess what? He's going to use us to enforce it upon uh, uh, upon the earth world to the other to the other nations. That's why we're going to have to beat them because they don't they're, they're not going to get it like that. When we tell them, oh, you, uh, you, uh, you, uh, you can't do this, you can't do that. They're going to be like, we're not going to write it upon their hearts. We're like, okay, you got it. No, man, they're going to they're going to fuck up, you know. Hey, just like we got to follow their system. So exactly. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you guys. Y'all the ruling class same, same, same people. Thing. You know, Jake fuck up on the laws. Shit, it's millions of fucking laws I don't even know about. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. This is uh, Isaiah chapter 2, verse 3. It says, And many people shall go and say, You feel me? So many people shall go and say, Come ye, and let us go up to the mountain of Yahweh, to the house of the power of Jacob, and he will teach us of his ways, and we will walk in his paths, for out of Zion shall go forth the law, and the word of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai from Jerusalem. Right, because if you read clear, if you clearly read Deuteronomy the fourth chapter, the Lord was not talking about all that. Matter of fact, if you read Deuteronomy, if you read uh, in, uh, Leviticus, Numbers, and Deuteronomy, it always says, "Speak these to the children of Israel. Speak these words to the children of Israel. Go to the house of the children of Israel. Say these words to the children of Israel." Why does it have to say that if they were giving it to everybody? All right. Yeah, so. And give an example too, like anybody that's ever been in a manager position or supervisor position, or you worked under manager or you know supervisor, like you, your job, yo, you have a boss, and your boss have a boss. Mm -hmm. You don't bypass your boss to speak to his boss. Right. The, the the big guy, he gives it to the guy under him. And sometimes the big boss doesn't go to me to tell me something to do about my job. Right. I mean, if he if he see it right then and there, he will. Right. But if he said, if I fucked up on orders or anything, he don't, he like, hey, check me out, you didn't do anything. Yeah, I'll let you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, the, that's, that's, that's order, that's hierarchy. Yep. That's even, even, in which Esau got that from us, but even in Esau's system, like even, even uh, the court system, you can't just talk directly to the judge. You'll talk to your lawyer, the lawyer talk to the judge for you. If you're in the army, you can't directly, if you are an NCO, a non-commissioned officer, meaning a private, uh, a private first class, sergeant, etc. you can't just address a corporal or uh, 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 lieutenants and, lieutenants and, and uh, colonels and not corporals, so like your colonels, because that's a full word, a colonel or a major, you know, like that. You got to go through the chain of command. And when um, in the kingdom of heaven, in the kingdom of heaven, the statutes and laws and commandments going to be within us, where it's going to be our, uh, you're not going to have those second thoughts to tell you to do evil. You're just going to have one, one mindset, and that's righteousness. The heathen not going to have that. So that's why they're going to have to learn. They're going to have to be taught. That's why the scripture says, man shall not teach everyone his neighbor, mm -hmm. for they all shall know me. Because the Lord going to put that, that down low within us. Yeah, I appreciate it. The only ones you're going to be teaching is the heathens. Right. When you go into a store, can you go against that store policy? When you go to me, I actually ask this. If you go to a fast food restaurant, you want something on your sandwich that don't come with, they say, well, we can't do that. It's against store policy. You know? McDonald's is the exception, but that's a multiple problem. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Zachariah was already a cesspool of concoctions anyway. Exactly. So they, they McDonald's they, actually makes special orders. You can do whatever you want. But you get to a restaurant, you can't just order mixed dishes and you know. Like they couldn't come to y'all y'all old restaurant and say I want a goddamn pork chop because right. y'all didn't serve yeah, pork. Exactly. pork. It's against store policy. This is Zachariah 14, 16. And it shall come to pass that everyone that is left in all the nations that that which came against Jerusalem 
shall even go up from year to year to which, worship. Which is all of them. Which all is right? all the other don't, don't say, oh, oh, well, well, China really didn't really say nothing. No, man. The book of uh, Ma Maccabees, it says, who haven't had a hand in our, uh, in our taking. In and our Moab story. was one of the first ones. Yeah. Yep. And, oh, well, oh, oh. <coughs> shit, was that Eglon? Eglon, yep. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And then the Lord told Moses, vex them for they have vexed you. Mm -hmm. uh, it said, uh, that should come to pass, everyone that is left in all the nations which came against Jerusalem shall even go up from year to year to worship the king and the Lord of hosts and to keep the feast of tabernacles. Yep. And, it shall, and it shall be that whosoever will not come up to, for whosoever will not come up for all the families of the earth unto Jerusalem to worship the king. See, you're going to have the option to break the law. Yeah. See? Yeah. I was <laughs> I was just, I was just gonna say, wait a minute, tabernacle, that's an Israelite custom. Right. Why is it he even going to doing an Israelite thing? And right. it's gonna say they must. Right. So that seems yeah. like something they, they, they're, they're kind of forced to do. Right. Yeah. So we'll get a punishment if we don't. Exactly. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, right here. Right. Go, Go ahead. ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> Isaiah 16 and 12. For the nation and kingdom that will not serve thee Ooh. shall perish. Yea, those nations shall be utterly wasted. Mm. Yeah, let us talk about that. If you don't do that, That's man, you can one. Oh. <laughs> Go read for me. Go ahead, Are right. right. right, you good? Zechariah 14, 17. It shall come to pass that whosoever will. Them niggas, man. Call them niggas fucking God, man. It says, and it, shall, and it shall be that whosoever will not come up of all the families of the earth unto Jerusalem to worship the king, the Lord of hosts. Even upon them shall be no rain, and if the family of Egypt go not up and come not and have no rain. You know how important rain is? Because hmm. you got to think, if it say beat your, pl beat your swords into uh, plowshares and pruners, you're going to need rain for because the, the world going to go back to uh, agriculture being the main source of uh, someone's livelihood. It should be. Uh -huh. Cattle and beans. That's what, and stuff. right. That's why the Lord said, I will give you the latter rain in due season, because we was mainly, we mainly dealt with agriculture. You know, you had land. If you got a whole bunch of land, you got to have, you know, agriculture. Why, why did the Lord describe the land of Israel as being the land of milk and honey? If agriculture was not a big deal. Right. You know? why, is the, why is the earth in such a bad condition because of mass, uh, the mass demand of beef? You know, you have to make them slaughterhouses to, for the demand of McDonald's and Burger King and the, and the, and the, and the meat on the shelves at Ultras and uh, back at Van Til. You know, if you have your own, man, you can, you can eat uh, 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 proportionately, man. Yeah, right. exactly. You know, you don't, you don't need 20, 40, 40 cows to feed a family for a year, man. Exactly. Exactly. You know, you can eat proportionately. And then, and, and then on top of that, even if 20 or 40 cows, that might be a cut ass. Because who says you're going to eat beef the right. whole year? Right. You're going to have chicken and, 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 and turkeys and, and, and lambs and goats. And, you know, says yeah, the whole... So Sorry. The so-called white man limit our people to like to, to certain food, man. Right. Watch the animal planet. You know how much yeah. lawful shit it is yeah, out there, really? yeah. yeah, giraffe is lawful. And Paula. Yeah. I mean, yeah. they got and shit that we ain't yeah, even really seen. Yeah, and you just be looking at it like, look at this thing. Why aren't you, why aren't you importing, that, 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 importing that, that meat or 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 or, 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 or harvesting uh, um, them animals, man? Because you know you, you can't you can't go over to somebody else's land and shit and and and, and do what you're doing in America, man. Because America, the reason why we got a lot of these diseases, man, is because they uh, they took the, the, the industry from the farmers, man. You used to have farmers that are high, make, make a high, say he had a thousand head of cattle, okay? And that beef, that beef that he manufactured was sat with his that's seed. His, that's his and, and you can, when you get diseases, you can trace it back to his farm. He said, hey, they look, man, you getting fined for this because you got blah, blah, blah. That's not no more. They got what they call um, KFOs, which is farm lots. You go to a farm lot and all the farmers in this region might ship they farm, they, they cows to that CAFO. And you might have like a million cows that's grazing and eating and being slaughtered, man. So how in the world can you can you trace that disease back? You just gotta trace it back to that case where all them cows at. You can't trace it back. That's why when they had a beef recall, they say, uh, uh, Remember when they shot beef for cars, they say, yeah, this goes back to such, such, such farm. They don't do that no more. They just say, yeah, if beef you that was Indiana, sold to, to this store, right, these, right. these chains don't eat. They you know say like, like, uh, so like yeah. yeah. But not too long ago, it was the romaine lettuce thing. We yep. Now, yep. it God. was like, well, it was like certain cities. It wasn't like, well, if anybody got from this farm or this store, it was like, look, these 10, 15 cities yeah. don't eat yeah. romaine lettuce. Don't <laughs> eat romaine, yeah. Like, what the because fuck? Because you can't, you, can't, you can't trace it back to where it come from. Because all those farmers 
Uh, the government has took out, see, the government, government has governmentized everything, man. Uh, uh, they, the, the, the military, and that's why another reason that shows that, that you, you, we are uh, finna go into martial law. The government runs everything, man. You know what I'm saying? It's nothing privatized no more, man. You know, you get a business, man. That's why with, with uh, Facebook, uh, uh, what's the dude? Uh, Facebook, Zuckerberg. Yeah. They, um, uh, the government wants to take his, take that shit from him, man. Yeah, yeah, you're in violation, man. You've been, you've been uh, uh, spying on people. Blah, blah. They're going to take his shit, man. The they government. It wasn't his for the big Well, yeah, because he, because whenever you got something like that, that, that deals with the FCC, man. That's all government, it, government shit, man. Yeah, they're the biggest hypocrite because the NSA is on everything and everybody. Yeah, that's right. That's how. That's why uh, Pastor Goodbye said that uh, it's the spirit of the Lord protecting us because the things we say when we come out in the highways and byways is high treason. Yeah. You know? Yeah. When, I, when we say yeah, America is going to be destroyed by thermal nuclear weapons, yeah. and this video goes on YouTube and the NSA reports it, yeah. You know, to the elites, that's high treason. Yeah. They can come and they can come for us, man. Yeah. They can come for they can come for us any moment. But you know what? We don't give a fuck because you know why? Yeah, how about show me how a shot got us, man? That's right. And he controls you, elite, uh, uh, the Rothschilds. And, uh, go ahead, go ahead. Uh, yeah. go ahead. What was that? No, no, no. I was just saying what you said, but I was going to say, uh, go back to that Romans 13. Yeah. I mean, uh, uh, I get to back up. Go ahead. To, 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 to back up what Shamar said. This is uh, John chapter 7, verse 30. I'm going to get, uh, I'm going to get there. It says, then they sought to take him, this is how Shana talking about, but no man laid hands on him because his hour was not yet come. Right. All right. All right. So right. basically, you know, Yahweh Shah was talking, you know, he was preaching, and uh, the, 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 the wicked scribes and Pharisees sought to take him. They wanted to actually take Yahweh Shah and give him up to the Romans. But guess what? They, but no man laid hands on him. Why? This hour has not yet come. It wasn't for that time to come, man. So just like, uh, uh, just like Shamar said, Apostle Gabar talks about uh, it's, it's Louis, how about Shemiyasha protecting us, because guess what our time is not? Each single one of us, uh, Akim, has a time, uh, 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 has a time where we might be tipping up. We have a time for escape. We have a time for everything. Our, our set time is already set, you know? That goes back to the Job 14 and 5. He has set his bounds. Uh -huh. That apply to everything. Yeah, yeah, everybody, no. e everybody got their, okay, got their, uh, like, uh, when you go into uh, Greek mythology, the system of faith, everybody got that little stream. You know what I mean? Yeah, so yeah, the yeah. Lord got it like this. Your life, hey, when you you fulfill your purpose, boom, cut you off. Yeah. Like even if it's even if you evil and wicked, like yeah. John Wayne Gacy. You know what I'm saying? Look, this your purpose to be an evil, weirdo, yeah. bugged out nigga. I'm gonna use you to kill these couple niggas. That's right. You know. Yep. Hey, just like just like my boy, even though this is the only thing I agree with. But my boy Neji of Naruto, he said. enemies yeah. by the Lord by us too Lord willing we saying treasonous things so if and when these people do come down on us hey we got the scriptures the scriptures gonna be our defense That's right. all right ultimately the Lord gonna be our defense if we stick within what the scriptures say
trying to think. This is not coming to me. Uh, 1419. 1419 says the waters where the stones, not washed away. Anybody have something? Let's talk about the Lord. It says, uh, Lord, Job, it talks about, uh, I think it's Job 12. It said, uh, it's four. Job 4. Okay. Four what? Four. And. Seventeen. This talks about uh, seven things the Lord shall deliver thee. Five. That's five. From no trouble. That's five. Five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Break that off the shot. This is Job My chapter. Just got robbed. This is this is Job chapter five verse nineteen. Okay. Says he shall deliver thee in six troubles. Yeah. In seven there shall no evil touch thee. There shall no evil touch touch thee. You know. And it says that a lot. It says that a lot in Psalms, man. A lot in Psalms and Proverbs. So the Lord is gonna, the Lord is gonna uh, use the knowledge and the wisdom that He gave you. You know, you're gonna rely on that through faith. You know, and relying on that faith because you believe, the Lord is gonna deliver you. Isaiah 33 and 6. It says, uh, "Wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy times, and uh, 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 and strength of salvation. The fear of the Lord is His treasure." So, in what time? The times of Jacob's trouble. Man. When, the, when the enemy come in like a flood. When you're looking at your, your your woman and your baby losing weight, you gotta still trust and depend on the Lord, man. Yep. That's that's all I wanted to get because it says it shall deliver in six trumpets. Seven. 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 That shall no evil touch. Because that seventh trump is that 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 that's game over. That's that nuclear thermal destruction. Right. All right. That's the death of uh, our people. Uh, gonna die the death of the wicked. But that death is for Esau. But hey, if you don't want to get right, you 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 gonna be in that too. But it say, uh, verse 20, in famine, he shall redeem thee from death. Man. All right? And in, and like like he did Elijah, man. Well, when it, when there was a famine in the land, the Lord sent birds to feed, sent ravens, I believe, right. to feed right. Elijah, man. Right. So what? We got to, that's why the scripture said the things written before time was written for our learning that we through patience and hope might have comfort of the scripture. Mm -hmm. Rough and fair phrase. Yeah. So like, you read no, so you read those stories and you that, that strengthen your faith your like man, yeah, Lord willing that happened to me. Yeah. Or or if not, you gotta have that uh uh that Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego yeah. spirit. Right. Say, look, our God can deliver us. Yeah. But if he don't, we still not gonna serve your 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 yeah. Yeah. So it's it's it's, it's twofold. Yeah. Right. You gotta have that spirit like look, Lord, I want you to deliver me because I know you can. But even if you don't, I'm still gonna serve you. Say for your sake, we all uh, we all uh, killed all the day long. So if I gotta What's die, that? then let me die like a man. Let me die to, hey, what did, what did, uh, what did, uh, what did Baal, uh, Balaam say? Let, let me die the death of the righteous. Yeah. Hey, that's, that's crazy. You mentioned the Saturday night, you know, the Shad, I remember going to church, bro, and then a Jake preacher was like, Shad, back, he shack got a bad Negro. Now he was saying he a bad Negro, but you want his stuff to go outside. Anyway, I got I got a precept oh, if I could. This is um this is Romans chapter eight verse thirty five. Who shall separate us from the love of Yahweh Hamashiach? Shall tribulation or distress or persecution or famine or nakedness or peril or sword? As it is written, for thy sake we are killed all the day long. Right. We are accounted as sheep for the slaughter. So you can do nothing to us that the Lord has not already done. Right. <laughs> We are, we are counted as sheep to the slaughter. Nay, in all things, we are more than conquerors through whom, through him that love us. Right, right. Yeah. No, 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 no. We uh, start at the top. Wisdom of Solomon chapter 3 verse 1. But the souls of the righteous are in the hand of Yahweh, and there shall no torment touch them. You know? That, that's that's speaks for itself. It says, in the sight of the unwise, they seem to die, and their, their departure 
is taken from mis for misery. It says, they're going, they're going from us to be utter destruction, but they are in they are in peace. For though they be 